we're going to make the double spiral today it's a spiral on this side as well as on this side and if you see it looks a bit like a conch shell from both sides it's it's a model that's been designed by tomoko fuse the prominent japanese expert on origami it's made with four pieces of paper of identical size to begin with make sure that you have a piece of paper which is more than six inches and as thin as possible here we go we're going to start today by folding a modular design a double spiral by the japanese expert tomoko fuse it's folded with four squares of paper start by taking six inches of paper with the first sheet make the diagonal by joining two opposite corners together fold and unfold now get all four edges to meet the diagonal like this this is the first edge the second edge the third edge and finally the fourth edge fold this parallelogram on the on the uh, on the central spine and now fold it into a quarter fold and unfold now get the right side down to meet the central line turn it over and again get the right side down to meet the central line this is important once you're finished with your module make the rest of the four modules also identically for the assembly take two pieces and make them stand next to each other like this put your palm on the lower half and get the third piece under the valley and over the mountain like this get the fourth piece also to fit like this they will look like a windmill if you notice we start by folding on the creases that already are there first second and third and for the fourth one you'll have to lift the first piece and fold it underneath this is the end of the first cycle similarly we'll keep folding them cyclically one after the other at the end of each cycle the size of the four blades of the windmill should be identical we are almost down to the last cycle of our windmill so far third and fourth once you're done with this turn the paper over and start by folding exactly like the other side the first creases the initial creases are already there one two three and four four blades same size this is how it will look right before the last cycle as you do this you will realize that the paper now is too small to hold take a dab of glue in the other hand and twist the last four panels together like this into a point a spiral literally in a spiral movement like this once the glue dries up it will be a pointed edge like this and that is how your double spiral looks we hope you have fun playing with the spiral if you hang it on one end with a thread you could hang it either in the center or in any of the edges have fun <laughs>